sometimes we are depressed and sad because we just push ourselves like too much so like if you're feeling like you're tired you don't have like motivation literally just stop for the morning or for the day journal about what you're feeling journal about your week and then write these and then write like mini goals for the week like for me it's to journal more meditate and walk because i do have a lot of i do put a lot of exercise in my life but it's more like gym like i do not have contact with the nature and it just feels different like when you have contact with the nature so today i just thought i'm gonna do a mini vlog of my day so yeah instead of being at the gym i'm just around nature basically and it's pretty much like I think the second time that I record outdoors and I don't know it just feels so different I think that's something like we all could do you know sometimes like it is crucial for us to have a morning routine like some I believe there's like two types of morning routines there's a morning routine where you do like you know every day that you go to work you go to gym you go to uni or to school and then those like morning routines that you do like today it's basically the same thing but you just change one thing or another so but the main thing about morning routines is just it's like literally what he says like a routine and you know what to do every day so some people I believe like I was one of those people like I would think like to do everything that I want that would like with no you know routines no scheduling nothing nothing would be like the thing but actually for me it's the opposite like I started being more happy when I start having you know a set a set routine so if you're like feeling sad or you're feeling not motivated I challenge you to set a routine for yourself like if you like slow mornings and let's say if you like some slow mornings you could like wake up an hour earlier so you can have your breakfast you can have that time for yourself where you can meditate journal and all of that however if you are a really busy person you could give you could have like a, I'll give you an example for example you have work at 9 a.m. okay but you are like a morning person so you want to have you know your walks done in the morning or your team done in the morning like what I do is that so for me I know I have either to walk an hour or to go to the gym an hour so I would wake up at 6 a.m. change the place where I was recording but the thing is like I was telling you about my morning routine so I like to wake up two hours before and just to do my stuff because then I don't have time uh, you know throughout the day so I like to have everything done in the morning am I actually like a morning person so I prefer to do everything in the morning but for example if it's for you you can't wake up at 5 a.m. you don't have to wake up at 5 a.m. to you know be productive or to have a morning routine let's say like your times is like at 7 a.m. 8 a.m. 9 a.m. whatever suits you you can do that you know what I'm saying like you don't have to be you know that girl at that woman and to wake up like at 5 a.m if if you can't do that if you know your organism is not up to do that you don't do it like for me i can't wake up at 10 a.m i love to wake up like before everyone else because i just like quiet i like you know to wake up with the birds I just feel like I feel like so peaceful and but that's just me you know like you don't have to do that so let's say you like to wake up at 8 a.m. you wake up at 8 a.m. and you have your slow morning that's n nothing wrong with that 
just because you wake up at 8 or 10 it doesn't mean you don't have a routine or you don't have a you know or you're not productive it doesn't mean like that you know so I just want to tell you that you have to set a routine for yourself because it will give you some structure and it will give you that discipline so every morning you know I do this I have it's the time what I have to myself for myself it's not the time where you do you know what you think about life it's not the time where you think about your duties it's the time that you give for yourself and let me tell you that this morning I was making breakfast and I was just start thinking about all the things that I have to get done um, for today and I was like no 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 this time is for myself so that will happen but that's fine you just have to train your mind so many things for free which is nature and sometimes you just don't take advantage of it we just so you know into our lives into our routines that we don't appreciate and we are not grateful for what we have but I think we have to start from there I think if you want to be a happier person you have to see the greatness in things you have to be grateful for what you already have because if you think about it you already have the life that someone is praying for so isn't that enough to be grateful I think it is so yeah and let's start with setting morning routines as well because that's gonna help you so let's move on okay so that's it for peaceful moment <laughs> I know I'm joking so um, now I'm gonna go either to a cafe like just to study a bit I was thinking about Starbucks but I don't know like I do love a Starbucks don't get me wrong but like I have work at 12 p.m. and let me see what time is it so it's 8.22 so which means I have to be at home at 11 you know to do my lunch and all so uh, I think I'm going to I don't, I don't know I know I have to study and I was just thinking like to study like two hours from 9 until 11 and I go home so I'm gonna find a place to study this is like the big part the main part of the park so Starbucks it is so I love Starbucks so I just decided to uh, come here to drink a mocha I love mochas but I don't like the cream so I just always ask mocha without cream uh, here are just looking um, to the table on side on the side because they were just looking and I was like oh my god am I really recording <laughs> this but yeah then I ended up obviously recording otherwise you wouldn't be seeing me now um so yeah then I was literally just starting to um taking my computer uh to do my dissertation because sometimes I do believe that it, it is important for us to change the place where we study and you know to go to a place that you actually enjoy so you will be focused like 100% so that's what I did I stayed in a Starbucks for like two more hours and that was pretty much so thank you so much for joining me today this is basically what I do when I have my slow mornings and I try to do this like every day and let me know if you like the slow morning, what you do in your mornings. And I love you so much. I hope you have an amazing week. And I see you next time. Bye.